Soggy, but like the bread's not as crisp and fresh anymore. So there's that. But I'm just here chilling in my favorite spot. <clears throat> Why, wow, you guys? I totally demolished that bun me, and I am so parched right now. So I think I'm gonna go get a bubble tea. Of course, you always have to have a mask. I'm gonna go my rubbish away. green tea mantra. It's a bit of a mouthful, but let's see how it tastes because I've never had this before. I f***ed it up. Whoa, it's good. It reminds me of this boost green tea mango mantra. But I was just going to talk to you about the photo shoot and how it went. So it was a quick like 15-20 minute photo shoot and it was a collaboration between three people. Myself, um, this artist and the photographer. So the photographer um, was gonna take pictures basically in black and white. The artist is gonna draw whatever was shot as reference and he took some behind the scenes pictures um, and photos and videos as well and it was kind enough to help me take some behind the scenes shot for you guys. He wanted to like document the whole process. So yeah that was really fun. It was a quick collaboration. Um, so nothing like crazy, it's really just for like a side project. Really nice to just kind of do this because it kind of felt like it was my early days of modeling when I was just doing things. Um, 
out of um, a desire for wanting a creative outlet because I was stuck and consumed by pharmacy. So it was just something that I would do on the side before I started getting into professional modeling. I realized that as I'm holding the phone, it's quite shaky. So I'm gonna try to hold it still. I'm really glad I got to show you guys behind the scenes a bit. I'm sorry that I haven't been documenting myself behind the scenes. I'm just the type of person that don't like to bother other people when it comes to behind the scenes things. I also like to keep it professional. So sometimes I feel like, you know, um, it's kind of like, Time is money in this world, especially in the modeling industry, in the fashion world and all that stuff. And so it can come across as unprofessional if you are taking time out to do like things like this. But in reality, it's not. Like People are really welcoming of the idea and people are quite nice. Um, actually, while we were shooting, some guy came out and we thought we were going to get told off. And then he was like, no, no, can you please just like um, tag this place? And it was like um, an arcade, like the fountain area. So that's like an arcade. So it was really cute. And I guess it's because businesses are going under, so they could really use the exposure. It was kind of sad because we were wandering around and we noticed that a lot of stores were putting up for lease signs or for rent signs. So they were going out of business. So COVID definitely had a very real impact um, on our economy, on small businesses. So yeah, it was really nice to see that like he was like reaching out, he was like okay with us because normally like pre-COVID sometimes people are a bit funny about you shooting in like their grocery stores or like their um, cafes and things like that. But nowadays with like social media picking up, I think people are realizing that it's actually a really good way of getting free marketing. It felt really good because in a way you are indirectly or directly helping out small businesses. Um, anyways, off tangent again. Hopefully I can document more things like this for you guys. I know some people have been saying that they want to see more of it and I've been very like hesitant to uh, vlog myself when I'm working just because I want to maintain professionality. I also feel kind of awkward because I feel like I need to be in the zone and I need to like get into um, the act of performing because sometimes you have to perform like you have to look like you're um, you know getting into character for some sort of skincare or makeup or clothes and so I try not to vlog because I feel like that interferes and like I said um, in this world like nowadays especially with this industry time is money so you don't want to be wasting their time but the reality is people are quite nice so yeah I mean I'm gonna try to build up the courage to actually ask people to help me with vlogging or maybe just put it on the side um, so yeah I think that would be awesome to give you guys more of an insight into that for now I guess that's it I am off. Um, I'm just gonna relax chill in the Sun and yeah I'll, I'll see you guys in the next one don't forget to like um, subscribe and comment down below I guess that's it that's it for me um, I'm just gonna enjoy the rest of the day because yeah because yeah it's a nice day so cheers <laughs>